James over Boost MPH and welcome to Lawn Mowing Simulator. Yeah, this is where games are going. This is this is this is a thing. <laughs> um, and yeah, I had to buy it. I saw it on Steam and I just thought, hell yeah, I'll take it. So we've I've already done quite a few missions already. Um, so hopefully uh, you're getting an idea of what goes on a few missions in because I think it's it's just very tedious. Um, you're doing the same thing over and over again, but it's in some ways it's satisfying. So we're going to do a cheap lawn today. We're going to do a smaller garden. Um, we'll do one that does complexity, so the difficulty on how hard it is to cut that certain garden. Um, so I think I've actually done every single one of these. Yeah, but the you know you can do them again and again, and you get more money, and you can uh, uh, make yourself grow your business, and you can buy more tractors, things like that. So what can I do? So what we we're gonna get into it. Um, let's do the smallest one, which is 360 pounds. If we do this one, um, employee, that's myself and vehicle. We'll take my vehicle. Uh, yep, yeah, drop start. So the graphics won't look great. Uh, I've got a dying graphics card, so I can't push my graphics card too hard. I have, uh, I am trying to get a 3070, so at least I've got something. Right, here we go. So the frame rate might be a bit crap, but it should be fine. So this is the garden. This is the house we're doing. So this is a lawnmower. I think I might have to repair the blade. Yeah, let's just re let's just fill it up and let's repair the blade. Right, now we've done that. Let's start running around a garden, and what we've got to do is find p p rub uh, just things, rubbish or whatever in the garden before we mow it. You can skip this bit and go straight on the lawnmower, but doing that you do lose XP. You don't get as much, so I've, I'd rather just run around, quickly find them. I've got three to find, um, so you just get that extra XP. There you go, and a rocket. Right, so now we've done our ground check. We uh, head over to the lawnmower, and hopefully... Get on. Right, here we go. Uh, so to turn on the lawnmower, you just hold down X and it will take its time. And so each garden wants or has its own um, depth, uh, how much you want, how short you want to cut the grass. Everyone's different. So you just press start and it will just say so five to six centimeters. So if you press down and up on the D-pad, if you look on the bottom right, you can see the centimeters change between five and six so we'll just do five for the short one um, and then to drive off you have to rev the engine up so we've got 100 rpm at the minute right on the d-pad brings up the revs uh, do not turn on the blades because you will damage it you do need to go on the grass first so let's go on the grass so what we're gonna do is I think I'm gonna cut you can cut how you like I'm just gonna do lines for this might take a bit longer because um, I think we've got we've got it says recommended finish time 20 minutes I'm gonna take longer than that but it is it, oddly satisfying it, the grass is quite short so it's not as satisfying as I'd like it to be but it'll be fine we we'll press X hold it down and start cutting try not to go near the flowers because you will uh, you will damage or you'll damage the flowers anyway and then you lose XP you can choose the speed as well um, going too fast can gunk up the blade uh, or you know clog it a little bit but being the grass is not too long it should be perfectly fine so we're gonna head around and do the edges first uh, there is first person view if you like first person indeed I do but I won't be doing that the whole video because it gets uh, you know it's the same view gets boring so uh, let's just cut this grass Yeah, we'll do the march rows at some point. Uh, so this game, you can actually got two choices. You can use um, a steering wheel, which is the new G uh, 920s, things like that. Um, I know the Logitechs are supported. I don't know if the Thrustmasters. Right now, we've done the edge. We can start doing our lines. And as you can see, how satisfying that is. If I turn the revs down, oh, I turned it off. Okay, I press the wrong one then. So you can see that the grass cutting is actually really nice. So <laughs> it's 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 pretty satisfying. So it's five centimeters, and we're now going to do our straight lines. Well, or try to do our straight lines anyway. Uh, so let's start that way. Uh, 
Oh, I did turn the blade on. That is the most obvious mistake. It does say engage your blades. I, I obviously didn't because I'm stupid. Right, let's turn on the blades. And you can see, look, the tyre marks in the grass. Looks brilliant. <laughs> I love it. Right, let's cut some grits. Uh, how much we got to do? Yeah. Nice straight lines for me. Wow, did, did you see that? The way that just spazzed out. <laughs> okay, that, that worked. Just cut this bit here, I missed a bit. Once you start getting your straight lines going, it's pretty easy. Uh, looks like I'm clipping on the mic a bit. I shouldn't be. Looks like I'm clipping though. Right. Let's do another straight line. It's, it, it is difficult. On the controller, I'm using an Xbox One controller. Um, it's a little bit finicky on the steering, but it is generally fine. Now, this game is definitely something you want to do if you want to sit back and relax. There's two lines. So what we're going to do is we're just going to go back over the bit we missed earlier because the blade was a bit short here. As you can see, the lines are beginning to show. Right, now we've done that bit. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Them lines, boy. So good. Oh, right, turn the blade back on. So it might just be a grass cutting simulator, but there is way more to it than that. Because you, what you're doing is you're essentially building a business um, by cutting, lo mowing lawns and things like that. Um, which is so it's more of a, I'd say tycoon side. It's when it comes to businesses anyway. So it's not just cutting lawns, it's nice to actually get progression, um, XP, money, things like that. So we don't want to hit the flowers. So actually we're going to go round, we're going to do a, a bob round the, the flowers. Saves us having to do it later. I could go faster actually, but I don't want... Thing is, if... oh yeah, go penalty, I destroyed some flowers, I got too close. Now the penalties are not massive, I think hitting a flower is something like 10p. Like 10 pence. So, yeah, this is not too bad. I'm going to go a bit faster, actually. I don't want to blunk the blade up, though. I want to block it or nothing. We'll go a bit faster. There you go. That's full speed for this. It's 5.4 miles an hour ish. Yeah, did you hear that noise then? It just started to die a little bit. That's where we're forcing too much grass through. Where the grass is thicker on parts of the garden. Right. Let's cut through there. Now I'll do I'll do first person for a bit again. I don't want to get too close to the grass. I don't want that to be an issue. Right. What we got? I, re I believe we've got some lines, boy. Oh, yeah, look at them lines. Oh, yeah. I like a good set of lines. Right, I don't I could go around the other side, but I might cut around this flower bed as well. Yeah. I mean, doing lines is a lot more time consuming, uh, but it's just so nice to see. I wouldn't do it with every garden, personally, but... Actually, what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to cut around this. Just so I can do it. Oh, that was close. Any plants? I actually can see. <laughs> there, <laughs> there is lines on the grass. There is lines on the grass. That looks so good. Right, this does get a little bit difficult, what I'm going to do is I might just... I might just cut the lines and just quickly do... Just for video's sake. But I just want to show you how good lines look. It's quite realistic. Oh, my bit. Gone over a bit. So when we do that garden, we'll do lines going the other way.
Right, turn around. It's, it's, the game is still, I mean, it's a, you can't, <laughs> I'd say you can't, don't expect too much. It is a lawn mowing simulator, but it's, the developers have really, <laughs> really stood their ground on this one. <laughs> They've made something really different, which is what I love. I love them for it. Because I cut lawns in the real in real life a lot, so it's <laughs> it's <coughs> the game does does represent it pretty well what it's like in real life. But I said the satisfaction isn't as much as you would in real life with really long grass. It's not as crazy, but you still get it. It's nice to see that grass just disappear. Cut that. Round we go. Oh. So 39% already done. So that's actually pretty good. The lines are not straight, but they'll do. <laughs> they'll do. Oh god. Oh, oh lord. Uh, what do we got? Yeah, that's that's not straight. That's pretty bad, actually. So we'll just go straight on this one. Right, that's kind of straight now. Here we Yui. It's a nice house as well, mind you. Hang on. It's a cottage, little cottage. Porsche Cayman or Cayman. Uh, the in the uh, driveway. Rich people. Oh, I say with the with the controller, it's very finicky. But also with that, you get much more. Oh, did I go over it? Did I miss a bit? No. Oh, yeah. So when on your right-hand side, on uh, you'll see on the bottom, you've got your speedo and everything. I did forget to mention actually, and you've got this white bar that goes up as I cut. When that goes into the where the red arrow is, look, it nearly nearly red. That means that there's too much grass being picked up at once or cut too much too soon, too soon, but too quick, and it damages the blade, damages the engine, things like that. Yep, see, too quick and damage engine. Straight lines are happening. Wow. That is actually really pretty good. Oh, too fast again. See, I'm not keeping on it, I'm damaging my vehicle. And engine condition and the blade pretty quickly. Right. Once we've done this section, we can do opposite lines and the other way. Obviously, this lawnmower doesn't leave as good a lines as you would if you'd buy an upgraded lawnmower. That the upgraded lawnmowers actually do proper lines, where one one way does one like a darker shade of green, and the other way does a lighter shade of green. That's what I love doing. That on the other lawnmowers is possible, but you do have to upgrade to get that. And we're not there yet. I've only done about six houses, and each each house can vary. I mean, depending on the garden. I think the longest one I did was about 52 minutes, 55 minutes ish. So the game is it, it <laughs> takes a while. Right, this bit here, I'm not going to bother with lines. I am just going to cut because you're not really going to see this bit. It's only a teeny bit of grass. We're just going to cut this down. There's a bit of blade grass, bit of blade of grass missing there. I will do that. I can see another piece. 
Don't turn the blade on when you go on the concrete, you will damage it. Just always turn it off. Uh, it's a bit of grass there. Right, we're nearly done now with this bit. And a little bit, one more, maybe two more rounds to go on that. Already recording for seven, 17 minutes, so or 18 minutes now. So I know full well that I ain't going to get this done in 19 minutes. That's not happening. I'm too slow. But look at the difference it actually cuts the grass. <laughs> it looks legit. That looks legit though with the long grass. Right, let's cut this up. Get this going. Smooth with the cut. Oh yeah. That the other way. Ah, oh, I missed a blade. Uh, so that's the only problem with this. You do miss a lot and it does... It annoys me anyway. I like to make sure it's all cut. This cigar looks nicer now. The lines are worth it. These are customers happy. <laughs> It paid my wages. Keep thinking I'm gonna do it, I'm gonna do it, and then just keep leaving that bit of grass. That's annoying me now. And it's gone. Let's cut, carry on. Do a bit of first person. Just gotta change up. And that was straight. That was that's pretty this bit's a lot straighter than what I did earlier. Oh, there's a bit of grass there, I see it on the right. Damn it. Actually, I forgot to go around the flower bed, so we'll go around the flower bed. Makes life so much easier. I don't have to drive into it like that. I can just go around it. But if you go too quick and turn too fast, you can actually damage the gra uh, the soil underneath on the grass and uh, leave tire marks and that. So you don't want to do that. Because, yeah, you'd be paying for that. Just a little bit to go now. We're at a 16 minute mark. Lovely jubbly. Keep that grass curtain. Right. I reckon four more passes, I reckon. And I reckon we're done. That was close to the flower edges then. Could have killed some flowers, but didn't. Thankfully. So that we're on a second pass, third pass. Oh, it might be more than four passes actually, but Oh, this is so like twitchy. It's not the game's fault, it's it's nowhere near the game's fault. Maybe I will make one more pass. Ooh, maybe just. No, that's not happening. Two passes here. Blade's not wide enough. Oh look at the lines, dude. That looks so nice. And... Do you know what? If I if I push my butt, I might better get that 
19 minutes and 30 seconds. Is it 19 minutes? 30 seconds in. So I've got, wow, a minute and a half to do this lot last bit and underneath the arches. Right, I've got to do that under the arches. Come on, I can do it in... Yeah. Just under, uh, just over a minute. That will damage the blade. Right. Last bit of grass. Take it easy. And we are done. But we're just going to finish it off anyway. Just because I have to do my job properly. Uh, oh, my concrete. Blade off. And let's drive back. Right. Now. Uh, do we... How much grass have we got on our... Uh, we've, we've got three quarters full. So we could empty it. I think. You see the two green bags. That's where we empty it from. I'm going to check if I can. Yes, I can. So just reverse up to it. And then you press A, and it will empty, literally empty it out for you. Once you've done that, you just reverse it onto the trailer, and you're done. And we literally have like 20 seconds left. Hey, that's nice and clean. That is so clean. Look at the lines. The lines were well worth it. Yeah, it takes a lot longer, but. It just looks nice, and I've been for a game, I'll only do it the once, and then after that I'll just, just cut grass, because it's easier. <laughs> it also take me too long. So, penalties. You know I said 10p, that's not true. 10 pence. Uh, collisions, £4. Flowers destroyed, £4. Oh my god. Penalties and fines, £8. So we was going to make 340 we made 304 That's fine, I ain't got an issue with that. Uh, we are credible rank 2. What else we are not? Amateur level. And can I... Right, let me fix my... So we when every every now and again you have to fix up your uh, your lawnmower tractor. So just when you do, just go to the top and go to your garage. Click on maintenance and then you can repair ve vehicle. Full repair. Engine, full repair. Blade, full repair. And we'll fill up fuel anyway. It doesn't need it, but... And that's now fully repaired. You can use it again and again and again. It'll be perfectly fine. We have 3.8 years to spend. Um, upgrade for 1500. What does that do? Oh, it's HQ. Purchase HQ. So you can upgrade, obviously, and get bigger. We've got the smallest at the minute. Advertisements as well. So you can also advertise your business. And that costs you, say, so for one day, it will cost you £250. Um, and you obviously got your 500 pound for five days, and you got your 1250 for 20 days. Now we've done that, I believe. Uh, 1300 for that garden. That must be huge. That would take at least an over an hour to complete. So I wouldn't do that unless you really want some time to yourself and you just want to sit on your computer. Well, I hope you enjoyed this somewhat strange video of Lawn Mowing Simulator. <laughs> it really, I mean, what game's gonna come out next, I don't know. It'll be like Hair Cutting Simulator or something like that. <laughs> I think that's what's gonna happen. If this is a thing, God knows what's next. But I hope you enjoyed it. And if you did, remember to like, share, and subscribe. And I'll speak to you in the next video. Don't you love me?